I would do the pizza, hit done, do another pizza, hit done, do the salad, hit done, before you print it. Because if you try to do it all in one order in the screen, it doesn't print out exactly right. Rough. Yep, it'll be like that for the first hour. Or it has been in the past, we'll say that. He's a boy growing. things well it broke my arm I have no business I know. It's fabulous I know <laughs> how'd you break your arm I fell when we were walking I've been cooped up with her too long I'm tired of it yeah <laughs> he beat me up <laughs> <laughs> rolled her down the hill mm-hmm yeah. pretty much that's what happened oh no do y'all have an order just the growlers no we're just getting growlers do you know what you want in those IPA for me and the dancing for uh, the stout for me, the stout. Yeah, I keep thinking about you guys because right now it's icky. I mean, yeah. you can't do anything. Yeah. Are you getting? Is anybody buying gift certificates or anything? Mm -hmm. No. Nope. We're just writing it out and dancing in the brown stuff. Fixing things up. Yeah. Do you know what category you will fall under when they give you like reopening orders? Mm. We we could be open right now. Actually, yesterday is our first day when we haven't been had it closed. Oh, okay. But people aren't traveling, so. Yeah, they're not. Because they don't know what's going to be open. Yeah. Like, mm -hmm. if they get to town All of my reservations have canceled for the, for the, all of March, all of April, all of May. I had a wedding in May that's been, there. well, for now, they're going to move it to, to September. So we'll see how that goes. And I have another in September. And I still haven't seen a date. Um, so I don't know. We'll see what happens. We get stuff up for them some too. And I got over there saying they had heard when they do open up, they're only going to be able to have like 40% of what they have. Yeah, that's what we keep like hearing that. too. So you'd, you'd have 40% of your capacity. I mean, we have a decent. I don't think a bar. People are going to be up moving around, talking. Yeah, and all that yeah. Stuff, they are. So. It's like, it's not going to work. Yeah, I could I could have three bar stools up here, but there'll be 20 people at the bar all night. Yeah, so, right. I mean. And then you saw, yeah. like Especially over in the California, when they opened. Right. Hey, look who's here. Hi. Yep. Well, we were there yep. the beaches, and you couldn't already move on them, and now they're shutting them back down. Yes, I saw that. Great. I don't think we'll have a vaccine by September. Oh. Well, thanks. Have a good night. I guess we were anticipating getting some sort of a date. And now that we don't have a date, I don't know what to think. Am I gonna open in May? I don't know. Am I gonna open in June? Gosh, I hope so. <laughs> if I can't open in May, I better open in June. So, I don't know. It's, it's that, I think we talked about this before, the um, having, having your business taken out of your hands is really hard because you're in limbo and it's, it's, a, it's a type of limbo that I have no control over. So if, if if I do something wrong and I have an issue here, I know exactly what I have to do to make it right. There's nothing I can do to make this right. There's no way I can do anything right now until the governor tells me I can open. So, it's hard. I mean, I don't know. I'm sure there's a better word for it, right? No, but I, I just hard. don't know. It's just, it's, it's, it's really, really difficult, and it's really frustrating and and unnerving and um, disheartening, and it's every other word <laughs> that that goes with it. So, yeah, I don't know. So we'll see.
Yeah, so we're hanging in there. We're anxious to reopen. Thanks. So are we. <laughs> yeah, we're anxious to see you in here. Thanks. Have a great night. Looks so like got some of your help back. Yes. That's we're great. We're trying on Friday and Saturday. We're trying to pull somebody in for even an hour. Terrific. Like an hour, hour and a half. So. Yeah. Because that first hour, and hour and a half sometimes is busy on Friday and Saturday. So. That's good. That's been... And everybody can use a couple bucks. Yep, yep. And what are we doing in these? Uh, you know you're hungry again, aren't you? And, uh, After I worked out, I'm real hungry. It says restaurants to reopen. Outside patios. Lori, are you going to uh, consider that to be an outside patio out there? Yeah, I don't think we're going to, I don't think we'll be able to be open for that, unfortunately. Um, yeah. I think I can only get like three tables and maybe 12 people out there. Yeah. So it w might just be better for us to Good. wait until the following week. Yeah. And open. I hate to say that, but. Well, you just gotta do what you gotta do. I just, I think that's probably our best option. We had some Baltimore Orioles come to our feeders today. Did you really? Oh my gosh. Yeah, they're beautiful. And we hadn't seen one at our house for several years. Yeah, boy, I don't know. I'm getting a lot of cardinals the last couple yeah. years, but I, I that it, previous it, to that, I hadn't seen any of them either. On here. Well, we've had lots of cardinals. We've had um, um, rose-breasted um, gross beaks, and you know some odds and ends like that. And uh, I yeah. noticed the um, finches. The um, what do they call them? Pink finches. Rose finches. Rose finches are back also see i'll have to look some of those up because i've got some interesting little birds we have a tree i think it's a crab apple or something it's some kind of a flowering ornamental tree right underneath my kitchen window and i get tons of tiny little tiny little birds i don't know if they we wrens. have these little wrens that have a <laughs> nest right over top of our garage where our downspout comes down it's up one top wedged on a stone and the downspout. It's like up in between the two. And it has like three sets of young. Oh every my year. gosh. A lot. And so the other day, Rich was working on the tractor on the pad right next to where they were. And they had kicked them out of the nest and they were trying to get them to go over to the woods. They were all over the tractor, under the they tractor wheels, under the wheels every and everything. place. And we were trying to shoe oh, them to no. where they could be, and they go. Oh and they yeah, because they, can't. they couldn't and fly real good. Out. They'd only fly like six or eight feet, and then they'd be on the ground. Again. Right. Yeah, but they were learning. They, oh my gosh. In the end, they crossed. The, they got across to, to a brush pile over there, and our cats didn't even know they were out because oh, we were heaven. worried that our cats yeah. would well, we, find them. What I said, I think maybe the birds waited until the cats weren't around, and they knew the cats weren't around, and pushed the young out, because they were all out of